hello friends uh, welcome to vstudent blog in this video like we'll be updating our uh, uh, vconnect server ssl certificate so here when you see here like you are able to see that uh, we are able to see a error saying that uh, untrusted certificate uh, so we need to fix this so we will be like uh, adding a certificate uh, to our vconnect server so before that we will be creating a certificate uh, uh, creating certificate and we will be following the steps and uh, before creating certificate we need to generate a certificate template in a CSR server uh, where uh, we will be create duplicating a existing web server template and uh, we will create a uh, create a new template for our VM horizon server so let's jump onto the server uh, to the lab so I have uh, a CSR server like a certificate server where uh, uh, like <coughs> where we'll be creating a template so let's go and start so in my previous video I just shown how to configure a certificate server so this uh, the one which I created a video which is only the relevant to our our requirement so in that I didn't show anything how to configure IIS uh, uh, bonding SSL bonding certificate everything I didn't show it just just for our purpose we created it so this is uh, our uh, certification authority console where uh, uh, like if you see here certificate templates so we have a few limited uh, certificates available here so if you see web server in, uh, we have only options properties delete and all so to get more options we need to right click and click on manage and once you click that you will be able to see tons of templates and here we will go to web server uh, sorry web server certificate and we will click on duplicate template so here uh, this is the one which we are going to create a certificate uh, template for our connection server so once we go here then uh, uh, we'll go to compat uh, sorry, compatibility where so minimum what you want to set uh, that is uh, uh, like we'll leave it for default uh, which is 2003 so once that is done we'll go to general and uh, give the name to the certificate template I will give connection server so it is like uh, 2 years and renewal period is 6 weeks that is default so once that is done we'll go to request handling and uh, we'll allow select allow private key to export so then we'll go to security and uh, for authenticators users will kill will uh, uh, we need to uh, like uh, actually we need to en like enable enroll which is already done that is a good sign and domain users good so make sure that everything is set administrator also I will set it enroll so if you select auto enroll that is also good so but I will leave it default and click apply so this part is done and we are able to see connection server here so now I will close this one and uh, if you go to certificate templates like uh, we didn't see that connection server so we need to right click go to new and certificate template to issue and there we need to select the connection server and click ok now we are able to see the connection server template here so this part is done now so the new certificate template is created now so we are good here so in our next video we will we will request a certificate from our connection server and uh, uh, we will replace the existing uh, certificate so thanks for joining uh, please do subscribe my channel uh, we will join in our next video bye bye